Welcome to our lecture online. Earlier in this series, we encountered a very interesting series. We encountered the one that said 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus uh, all the way up to plus n is equal to n times n plus 1 divided by 2. And we're wondering, well, where did that come from? Now, we also learned in this series that the partial sum of a arithmetic series is equal to n times the first term plus n over 2 times n minus 1 times d, where d is the common difference. All right, is there a way to go from here to here? And the answer is yes, let's do that. So first of all, in this case, a sub 1 is equal to 1. So we can replace that. We can say that s sub n is equal to uh, n times the number 1 plus n over 2 times n minus 1 and d here is also going to be 1 because that's the common difference in this in this series so simplifying that we get s sub n is equal to n plus n over 2 times n minus 1 now let's put that on a common denominator so this is s sub n is equal to 2n plus n times n minus 1 all divided by the common denominator 2. Let's multiply out what we have in the numerator and see what we get. So this is equal to 2n plus n squared and n times a negative 1 is minus n and all that is divided by 2. So now we can subtract n from 2n and we get s sub n is equal to n plus n squared divided by 2. And then if we factor out an n, we get s sub n is equal to n times n plus 1, because I can reverse the order, all divided by 2. And that is the general equation that we had over there, which means that the partial sum of the first n terms of this famous series, 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 and so forth, is going to equal n times n plus 1 divided by 2. Now, we can check that again. Remember, when we want uh, s of the first 50 terms, that is equal to 50 times 50 plus 1 divided by 2. And so this is going to be 2500 plus 50 divided by 2, which is 1250 plus 25, which is equal to 1275. And that's the same result we got in an earlier uh, video. But that's where we use this equation instead of that simpler equation. But now you see that it's really the very same equation if we're dealing with this series instead of any general series. And that is how it's done.